The overall aim of this procedure is to create compositionally representative multi-species dental plaque biofilms in parallel for analysis. This is achieved by first creating a representative media and inoculum. The inoculum is then introduced to the microfluidic chip. After an overnight incubation, a biofilm forms inside the microchannel. Finally, the biofilm is washed and stained for in situ confocal laser scanning microscopy or epifluorescence microscopy. The main advantage to this technique over existing methods like flow cells is that it's a high throughput system that allows for multiple experiments to be done in parallel while using less materials and not requiring artificial lab media. To begin, collect saliva samples from a cohort of five or more volunteers in individual 50 milliliter plastic tubes. Pour the saliva samples into a single plastic beaker placed on ice. Avoid using glass beakers in this setup as saliva biopolymers tend to adhere to glass surfaces. Next, add dithiothreatol to the sample until its final concentration is 2.5 millimolar. Stir the mixture for 10 minutes on ice. Pull all contents into several plastic tubes. Perform a high-speed spin-down for 30 minutes in a 4 degrees Celsius chilled centrifuge to separate particulates from the sample. Transfer the saliva supernatant to a fresh sterile container and discard the pellet fraction. To prepare a bacteria-free growth medium from this sample, first dilute the debris-free sample with three volumes of deionized water. Then, using a 0.22 micron low-protein binding membrane, filter sterilize the saliva while keeping the post-filtered fraction chilled on ice. Aliquot